Vera Bradley has a new collection. I think it's called Garden um, Garden Party, I think it's called. So um, I want to show you a few of the things that they have here. They still have a couple of other Disney collections here. And we're going to go inside so that we can see some prizes. So I think this is the name, Minnie's Garden Party and Minnie's Garden Dogs. Is it? Yeah, okay, so this is what they look like on the outside and those have that um, fabric as the lining inside. Let's go look at them. Big table here, right as we walk in and we have two different kinds of um, sling bags. So this one is the small size and uh, let me see if I can get a price for that one. It's $55. How cute is that? And then the big one. Let's look for the price for the big one. The big one is $65. I love the colors. Yeah, I love it. It's more okay, so like this, this is... What is this? A wristlet. And it has a zipper on the back. And let's open it to see if the lining is like that. Let's see. Oh, just one hand. I need the other one. Wait. I love it. It's $45. And it has some... Um, pockets for your cards and some cash Ooh. and look at this for your ID they give you two of those and they have the holes in the middle that help you like slide out your ID I appreciate that very much now let's look at this one it's $85 and I think this is crossbody I haven't tried it but yeah this it looks like you can wear it as shoulder bag or as crossbody because it has an adjustable strap and this main compartment has a magnetic closure and then it has two pockets that are zippered like this and a front pocket that is also zippered the back looks like that or would that be the front i don't know you tell me is this a wristlet it's a wallet i think you have a snap button here and it is a wristlet it does have the wristlet strap Let's see if we can find the price here. It's $80 and it has the two separate compartments. I'm going to open them just to see if they have slots for cards. So the first separate pocket has slots for cards and let me see, can you, oh, and it has this big pocket here for your cash and you also get some other pockets here on this side. Um, you can open this fully but i just can't do it right now because of all these um tags and then it has a, a carrying strap and it seems to be adjustable it seems to be long enough to carry as crossbody so yeah that's it oh it has a zipper pocket on the back as well a crossbody bag it has two separate compartments on the front and it's 80 85 85 dollars it has um the straps are not detachable just so you know but it is adjustable and on the back it has this sliding pocket perfect for cell phones this big tote is 120 dollars and you have a zippered compartment big enough for a cell phone and then um like slip in pocket the main compartment has a zipper and um the back is Plain. I mean plain in the sense that it doesn't have any pockets. Let's look at the Weekender bag. This one is $140 and it has a big zippered pocket here. Let me open it so that you can see better, like the size. It's really big. And then a smaller front pocket. And then on the sides, it has pockets that are just like slip-in pockets. Like no security, no zippers, no nothing like that. I really like this detail here for the strap. Where you attach the strap, it has this ring. Which um, makes me feel like it's more durable and that it's going to hold very well. I don't know. I think so. Uh, on this side, there's no pockets. The straps are thick. And obviously the main compartment has a zipper. Let me see if we can open this to see what it looks like inside. Inside you can see that it has some mesh pockets here on one side. One, two, three of those. You can see the, um, the strap. And it has this like shoulder padded thing for comfort. 
Is it adjustable? It is. It is adjustable. And then on the other side, it has one, two. Two of those mesh pockets, but these are bigger. Um, something else that I want to mention is it has that like plastic um, backing thing. I don't know how to call it, but it's like a base that you put here. So it, it holds the shape. This backpack is $130. It has a front pocket here and then a bigger one here that I'm gonna open just to see if it has any additional pockets inside. It does have space for an ID and for pens and your phone and whatever else you need to carry here. And then the main compartment has two mesh pockets. Now this has, um, oh, there's another area here. I was gonna say that it's padded, like thickly padded. And this pocket on the back is for your laptop and it's padded on both sides. So this side is padded, the back side, and this side is also padded. So it's gonna be very well protected. It has elastic pockets on the sides, on both sides you get those. And let's look at the back here. So you have this strap to hold it or to like um, hang it from somewhere. Um, it looks very durable. Then the straps are padded and they have the curve to make it, um, I guess more ergonomic would be the way, with adjustable straps. And then, oh, there's another zippered compartment here, wow. So that's the width of the pocket, but the depth, it's all the way to the other side of the bag. So you can put a lot of stuff in there. And then it has this really cool feature here for when you're traveling, then you can put your luggage handle through this and then you only have to carry one one bag the wallet is sixty dollars when you open it you have this on one side and then you have a zippered pocket here in the middle and then some more uh, pockets for cards and then on this side you have a big pocket for like cash or something the id with the um, helping hole and then on the back, there's another zippered pocket here. Oh, oh, oh. All right. The ID case with a keyring is $20, but I don't know why this one doesn't have the hole here to help you slide it out. Is it easier because of this system? Oh, yeah, okay, that's why. Okay, makes sense now. All right, and then the inside has that other um, print and this is the back the lanyard is $25 and I love this ring it has two one like regular key ring and then a Mickey Mouse one that you open just by pressing here and then the actual strap is um, the dots design if it'll focus yes now this is called a passport wallet and it's $55 so it has this um, ring here so that you can clip it onto the lanyard and it has let me get close to that three compartments here at the top and I don't know if it's focusing I'm hoping and then on the back it has one two three slots four cards almost forgot to mention that this is like faux leather material and not the typical fabric as the other bags the small convertible crossbody is really cool it's 55 dollars and let me show you what makes it convertible so you have they give you two different straps so this strap you look through this area here and it's adjustable and you can wear it as a fanny pack but then you also get inside another strap that you can clip here on the side rings and make it a shoulder bag or a crossbody bag this one has a zippered pocket inside on one side and on the other side you get one two three i think or four is it three or four 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 um card slots and then the front has a zippered pocket they have another lanyard and this one is only $20 and I don't know why because I think this one is better. The other one is $25 and the strap is very thin, like maybe half of the, maybe even less than half the width of this one. And this one also has 
the two rings the regular one and the Mickey one so I don't know why this one is cheaper I like it this one feels like a beach bag to me let me see if I can find a price here seems to be here um, it's $75 it's called a family tote but I don't know I would get it for the beach it has this mesh um, like closing system with the drawstring and you can see it there it's very big very very big it has a separate pocket in the front and you can see the size of that it's very very generous and let me see what oh there seems to be a pocket here yes for like a cell phone or something that you would need like easier access to and then the back doesn't have any pockets this is so big and nice for the beach seriously and then let's move on to the cosmetic case so this one also feels like that like faux leather material and it's super cute let's open it this one is $45 and I love that the inside is covered with plastic so that it's not gonna get ruined if anything that you are carrying here spills let's look now at the cooler backpack it is $100 and on the front it has a separate pocket inside you find two mesh pockets this one is smaller just this width and then this one um, is a lot longer for anything else then the straps here are very thick and they seem to be capable of holding a lot of weight then here it closes at the top with a zipper and when you open it it's one of those bags that has um, like a structure it has some like metallic structure so it keeps open now inside it has that how do I call it like insulation like system so uh, and it also has plastic so that um, whatever drinks that you have that are cold and are having some condensation won't ruin your bag this is so nice let's look at the back oh on the side it has a pocket and it has obviously the backpack um, straps that are adjustable they are padded and then there's another pocket here let's see how big is it I think it goes all the way to the other side of the bag so it's a very big pocket and then on the other side there's another pocket here and a separate pocket they thought of everything drawstring cinch bag this one has a pocket here on the front let me open it it opens wide and it has two pockets here then you can see here that you have two pockets are these elastic they seem to be a little bit elastic so you have two of those one on each side and then the back the back doesn't have any pockets and then inside are there any pockets yes there's one zippered pocket here and I think that that's where I can find the price for this one it's $65 the cord on this one is very soft I think it's important to mention that because that's what bothers me the most when I get bags like this but this one is soft and nice and even like plushy this collection also has a blanket it's 80 by 50 and it's 65 dollars i'm going to insert a picture of what it looks like extended i think i've covered all the items from this collection but that doesn't mean that they don't have other collections they have the sweet treats collection still here so if this is the one that you wanted you can still find it i'm loving this one um I don't know I like the shape of it let me see if I can show you it has this front pocket here doesn't have any like snap um, buttons or zippers like no security but then you have a zippered one here on the side it's like hidden can you see that I think that's really cool then it has this string so that you can cinch it I'm guessing that's very nice it has full leather trimming and let's see let's open it the main compartment has a zipper 
It's $105. And look at the lining. I love it. I have one piece from this collection. And I'm thinking that I want this one. I'm not going to buy it today, but I'm going to think about it. It has another pocket here on the back. But then they have other styles, like the ones we saw from the other collection. So we're not going to go into detail, but you can get something embroidered on them. What else? The Weekender bag. They have it here. Did we see one like this from the other collection? I don't think so. So we're going to look at this one. Again, this one has some um, faux leather trimmings. Let's open it. Is this removable? Yes, it is. Like the checkbook kind of thing. And it has a zipper here. And I do see some rings here at the top. So that means that there's a strap somewhere and you can carry a crossbody. On the front, there's a zipper compartment. And then when you open the middle one, you get basically what you get in every uh, typical wallet. And that's the strap. That's what it looks like. This one is $80. Then they also have the other convertible wallet, like the one we saw from the other collection. And the backpack. They wrote Imagine on this one. Um, this small crossbody bag, I don't think we saw from the other collection, so let's take a look at it. The front pocket. Oh, this would be great for Christina. Have you watched her channel, Christina K? She's awesome and she loves Goofy so much. This would be perfect for her. I'm gonna leave um, her channel in the description box in case you wanna watch it. Ah, okay, magnetic snap closure. And let's open it, ooh, card slots. Very nice. And for your ID. Oh, but I don't like that. I don't know, it should have been from the side maybe? No, I don't know, I don't, mm. Is it safe? Like when you open it, won't it like fall down? I don't know. I'm not too happy about that. But anyway, there's a separate compartment here and then the main one and a back pocket. The strap is not removable, but it is adjustable. It is $60 and it's called the Mini Hipster. They also have the crossbody bag, like the one from the other collection. And the sling bag. Remember how we saw that the other collection had two, a small one and a bigger one? This one is the bigger one. This is what I have, the cosmetic case, and I love it. This part, the fact that it's covered with plastic, I don't know why, that's what made me want it. I mean, obviously, aside from the print. And it has another pocket here on the front. Then, oh, the passport. The other one had a very different, like, passport, um, I was gonna say bag, but it's not bag, it's a holder. Um, love it, love it. This, this one is more like the typical one. Let's see how much this one is, and it has a zipper compartment on the back. This one is 50. Can't remember how much the other one was. So, don't know how they compare. The small convertible bag. What else do we have here? What is this? The tote, we already saw that one. The wristlet. This is a luggage tag. It is $20. And I also see that they have the lanyard. And this one is it's $25. And there's also a blanket that matches that collection. $65 and the same size as the other one, 80 by 50. Let's move on now to the uh, Colorful Meadow collection. And this is the luggage tag, $20 for it. And here on the back, we have the wristlet. Let's open it to see what the lining looks like. My boy Pluto. More items from this collection, the crossbody bag, and then the small crossbody bag, like the one that had Goofy on the other pattern. They have the wallet here. Is it the same one? Yes, it's the same style as the one that we just saw. And then this other little bag. Did we see this already? I'm not sure, so I'm gonna show you. Oh yeah, I think they had it. 
in um, the first collection that I showed, like the new one. But then they also have the cosmetic bag for this one. Oh, I grabbed a good one. Oh, and it has Mickey on the back. <gasps> Sleeping with Pluto. Oh, no, that's not good. I love it. <laughs> $40. What is this? is this? Is this for your glasses? I don't know. It has a strap. Let me see how they are calling this. Uh, cell phone crossbody. Oh, okay. All right. Let's see the back. The back has a little pocket here. Okay, then they have a small wallet, which um, let's open because we hadn't seen it. Very nice. It has a zipper. Oh, and then it opens even more. It's very hard with one hand, so bear with me. But you can open it. Oh my gosh. One second. Hopefully this is better. Um, you can see here that they have three pockets. So one is zippered and then this like main one i guess and another one here so you can divide your cash or use one for receipts or whatever and lots of um, sliding pockets for your cards and then on the back it has a separate compartment for your coins for change and then this other pocket here it is 60 dollars they also have the big family tote. This is the one that has a mesh cover at the top. And then they have the cooler one, the cooler backpack, the weekender. There's towels here. And then ID holder. And then we also have um, the lanyard with the Mickey Mouse. Let's move on to the uh, Mickey's Whimsical Paisley collection. And I'm gonna start showing you that they have an umbrella. And it's open here so you can see it a lot better. This one is $50, $50 for that one. Then here we have the cell phone bag and then the wallet. This is part of the same collection. This is the fabric that they use for the interior lining. I love it. I really like it. And then they have the ID holder and the lanyard. And then they have this style, 105. It's the same one that I was looking in the um, Sweet Treats collection. I think I like it better in the Sweet Treats one, but I don't know. This one, I mean, the fact that this one has balloons just like stole my heart and lots of Mickey Mouse. Oh, I don't know. Hard to choose, very hard to choose. And we have the tote. And then here at the top, we have a backpack. I'm not sure if it's exactly the same as the other backpack that we were looking at. This one seems to be more square, doesn't it? And what is that? That looks like a lunchbox. And that weekender bag there at the top, let me get back. Doesn't that look a lot bigger than the other one? I'm pretty sure that it is a lot bigger. Oh, and you can see the luggage tag hanging from there too. I found a smaller lunch bag and this one also has that protective plastic inside. It's $45. They also have the crossbody bag and the small crossbody bag. And I'm seeing the sling bag and oh, they put an S on this one. Giving you examples of what you can do with yours. This is the one that we were looking at up there and I think this one is different. Isn't it different? I think so. Yeah, because I think that the other backpack had a back pocket for your laptop and this one seems to have it too, but it doesn't open all the way to this side. I'm gonna open it. So it does open wide enough to fit your laptop easily, but it's definitely a different style than the other backpack that we were looking at. How awesome is the interior on this one? Oh my goodness! And look, it has this hole here. Am I showing it? Yes. It has this hole here so that you can put your um, cables through. Hmm, nice. This one is $130 and I just realized that this print also has the castle. You can also get the blanket from that collection. <laughs> I can see the castle on that one. You see that? Oh, wow. I wish I could see it open, like extended, to see what it looks like 
full but I mean you can go to their website and you can check it there and that's it that's all the Disney stuff that I can find here today I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one bye